kind of can't avoid it in order to get to work. So that's probably a good 10 minutes every morning to and from. Um, it also just feels a little more dangerous, admittedly. Neighbor Courtney Kleb started living in this neighborhood before construction began and says as it keeps creeping closer and closer to their neighborhood, some drivers look to avoid the traffic by cutting through their street, putting neighborhood kids and pets in danger. A lot of the traffic gets diverted off onto this road, so like especially late at night, we have a lot of like, I would assume drunk drivers that aren't really paying attention or realize this is like a really residential area, so they go really fast, and it's kind of a problem when you're walking your dogs. And some of the drivers looking for a quick detour end up in an unlikely destination. But I think it's been like maybe twice or three times now we've had, I'm, I think the, one of them was a drunk driver that went into the actual construction and broke a water main, so we didn't have